I need your help finding my son, Christoph. You work for Rise, don't you? Sure, for protection. But I can't go to him for a thing like this. My son is... he's young. He thinks with his mouth instead of his head. He doesn't understand that sometimes you've got to go along with people who aren't so good. Now he's run off to join Brecken's bunch at the tower. He thinks he's going to be a runner. That's not the safest line of work. He's going to get himself killed. He's not ready. He's too young to be out there. Shouldn't you be looking for him yourself? You don't understand. I make weapons for Rise. If the new ones aren't ready when his people come, me and Kristoff are both dead. Please, do this for me. I'll give you something good. Something special. Okay? Yeah, maybe I'll ask around at the tower. If I find something, I'll let you know. But if you ask me, your protection seems to have you pretty scared. You should really think about it. This was supposed to be a promotion. Can you believe that? Uh, excuse me? Coming here, to Haran, I'm... I was the media coordinator for the Global Athletics Games. <laughs> what a clusterfuck. Yeah, I guess the, uh, that whole outbreak thing really took the wind out of your sails, didn't it? You could say that. The hell of it is, I left my fiancé to take this job. Well, he couldn't come here with you? She. And no. She could have. She just chose not to. Said she didn't want to come to this to part of the world in, in the piece. first place. And certainly not for as long as I was going to have to be here. So I told her this was the biggest professional opportunity I'd ever had. And if she couldn't handle it, she couldn't handle us being together Look who it either. Is. Guess she had the last laugh. Oh well. If the biters get me, at least I'll never have to listen to her saying, I told you so. The radio signal is stronger than ever before. Easy. Come here. I've got a special deal for you. can receive transmissions from all the districts. Radio 
signals are stronger now. Thanks, great job. We'll make good use of this. You wouldn't have to know where Kristoff is, would you? Kristoff? You mean the new scout? I was supervising all the scouts. Why don't you ask him? He's on the 19th floor. Alright, that's it. There's nothing more you can do. Yeah, well, Rice can throw a lot more bodies at them than we can. No, negative. Cut your losses and get out of there. Copy. Out. Hey, Crane. Back from the field, huh? No, not for long. You know about a scout named Kristoff? Uh, the new kid, huh? Yeah, he went on a recon mission, but I haven't heard from him in a while. Rahim checked him out and said he was solid, but uh, I'm not so sure. One reckless kid certifying another. Uh, that's what Brecken said. Of course, it could be just his radio. Some of the batteries are running down, so we're not getting much range out of them. Where was he headed? Out toward that newly constructed skyscraper. All right, I better go have a look. Hmm. Watch yourself out there, all right? you, Kristoff. This is Crane. Where are you? I found some survivors. They're in pretty bad shape. We're just outside the hostel. Kristoff, hold tight. I'm on my way.
Okay, Kristoff, I can see you. I'm gonna get you out of there, but the first thing I need you to do is stop cranking that engine. You're just drawing him in. Right. Yeah, I wasn't thinking. Now stay put and sit tight. I'm gonna secure the area. Ready to go. Negative, Kristoff. Stay with the wounded. That's an order. I've secured a safe zone. <sighs> Never been so scared in my life. Is it always like that? Pretty much. Hey, but you kept your head on and you saved those people's lives. It's, it's not bad for your first time out. Thanks, Crane. But if you hadn't shown up, we'd all be dead. And how do you think your dad would feel about that? My dad? Oh, no. Did he send you? Look, I'm not going to go back. I can't. I'm not working for Rice and his butcher squad. Look, I'm not asking you to go back. Well, that's what my dad wants, isn't it? He wants you to be safe. Yeah, working for Rice. How safe is that? It isn't. Sooner or later, they're gonna kill him. But if I can get your dad to stop working for Rice, will you hang up your running shoes? You're asking a lot. You could make weapons for Brecken. God knows they need them, and you'd be saving your dad's life. 
Okay. Get him to join me here, and I'll quit being a runner. Did you find him? Yeah, I did. Your son's in one of our secured zones. But I thought you were going to bring him back. No, he's not coming back, Alexei. He's a scout working for Brecken. And unless he gets a lot better at it in a hurry, he's not gonna last too long. But couldn't you talk some sense into him? No. So I'm gonna have to talk some sense into you. You wanna save your son? You stop making weapons for rice and go to the tower. Now your son said he'll give up being a runner if you'll join him. No, no. Sooner or later, Race is going to tear that place down. It's not safe there. It's not safe anywhere, Alexei. And the question is, whose side are you on? See, right now you're on the wrong side, and your son doesn't want to have any part of it. You're right. He is ashamed of me. I am ashamed of me. But I'm just trying to do what is best for him. Well, then today's your lucky day, Alexei, because what's best for him, it's also the right thing to do. Okay. You win. What the? Where is your big mouth, kid? Rice!
It's always just a matter of time before they would come for me. They may come to the tower eventually. They will. But it is where I should be, with my son. In my case, there's a weapon I designed. Something special. I never crafted one because I didn't want to give it to Rise. I want you to take it. Good luck, Rain. Perhaps I will see you again. <laughs> <laughs> 